So why should you invest in a trading success course and why should you specifically invest in this trading success course? Well, this course, unlike other courses that I've taken, is a complete practical trading mindset system. This course is designed to be able to give you a complete foundation for the trading psychology that you will need in order to be a trade a, a successful trader. So first of all, why is this course necessary? Now, you probably already know that there has been a trading revolution in the past 10 years and that trading, electronic trading, has transformed trading from something that was virtually non-accessible to now completely accessible by everybody. So in the old days, you used to just have bank traders and you would have investors who needed a very large um, money pot in order to be able to invest in stocks. Um, but now with electronic trading, uh, you can open a futures account with a few thousand dollars and you can open a, a stock trading account with a few thousand dollars. Um, likewise, you can open a foreign exchange account with a few hundred dollars. So basically anybody can trade and you can open um, a, a an electronic account within a day. So, so it has been transformed. It's completely accessible. Now, what that means is that what because it's this situation has only occurred over the past 10 years there hasn't really been a a lot of successful traders that um over in the per, in the first sort of few years because obviously people had a learning curve and it does take years of training to become successful in most professions. And if you look at it from the point of view of, let's say you were training to be an architect, uh, training to be an architect takes you many, many years of training and you have a structured pathway. Well, trading is not a structured pathway. And so people are having to um, teach themselves most of the time it, unless they're lucky to have a mentor. So it can take years and years to become successful. But what you have been seeing now in the past, over the past few years, is that successful traders have gone through these struggles and they have been rising through the ranks. And you can see them, um, you know, on Twitter, you can see people, uh, accounts on FX Book and so on. But the thing to note is that most successful traders you will never hear about because they're just sitting at home making money. You know, they're not interested in selling courses. They're not interested in anything apart from just uh, working for a few hours a day. So unless there's a particular reason for a successful trader to promote themselves, most of them you will not hear of through social media. But you probably know yourself of um, through your family or through friends, you probably know people or you probably know people who know people who are trading at home successfully. I know that I um, know a few people through my family contacts who, who are just traders who just sit at home um, just, just making money. So most successful traders you won't hear about, which makes it even more difficult. So most traders are in a situation where they are struggling to reach consistency and they are also isolated because the struggle is a very private struggle. Most traders do not talk about the struggle they're going through. They, they may talk about their losses and their wins, but they're not talking about the internal problems that they're suffering um, from as they as they struggle to succeed in trading and so they don't realize that it's perfectly normal to feel like that and that um, it doesn't mean they're failing it just means that they they are struggling and they haven't yet found the way to succeed but and I would emphasize that word yet so the fact that you're struggling doesn't mean that you're failing, it just means that you're struggling. So it's important to realise that struggle is a normal part of the trading journey. But the key factor is that one person could take a trading methodology and succeed with it, while the next person is still struggling. So why is that? Well, I would suggest that 
Firstly, that trading methodology may be may jive very well with that person's trading psychology. It might be just the perfect trading methodology for them. It also might be that they've been able to adapt that trading methodology um, and they have a natural way of dealing with the, the psychological issues of trading. And they may not even realize that they have it, but they have just naturally adapted themselves to be able to deal with that. Um, and the next person who takes the same trading course, the same trading methodology, it may not be a good fit for them and they may not understand that and so they blame themselves. And I think this is a very big problem in trading is that traders who are struggling are blaming themselves. And if you watch my separate video on behavioral economics experiments, you'll realize that actually there are psychological factors which are too powerful to resist and so unless you really understand that that your psych instead of fighting against your psychology you have to work with your psychology the way it is you will constantly struggle but this trading course is designed to overcome that struggle and it's really a practical course on how to achieve the the mental game of trading so it builds on the information in my three trading mindset books which are very practical books so for example uh, the first one overcome your fear in trading then there's control your inner trader and how to stop over trading they are all very practical books and if you haven't already read them then I suggest that you do go and and get them they are available on Amazon so it's important that you accept that trading it requires a different mental paradigm and it's your normal uh, psychology the normal way you approach things in life is not sufficient to be able to trade and that's the reason that people struggle okay that's that's the only reason because trading itself is simple it's not easy but it's simple but the thing that's not easy about it is the is the different mental paradigm that you have to adopt but I suggest that you actually make a game of it and when you start seeing um, success and I'm not measuring success in terms of financial success but the way that you start changing your behavior you can actually make a game of it and enjoy the different trading you that is coming into being and just create the correct trading mindset from the ground up now once you uh, create the correct trading mindset then you can take a methodology and you will know what to do in order to succeed because you will have the foundation in order to do so so that is the that is the rationale behind this trading success course which is that it will provide you with a complete practical trading mindset system um, that will help you succeed with a trading methodology that suits your psychology.